Five years ago, when I started the company, I had no idea what value innovation was. <laughs> no idea. So what is AI? So any system, any machine that you build that can take input in many forms and do a reasoning on it and be able to do a task that potentially a human could do is AI system. So the way I would differentiate or the way I would define it is if you're building a machine right, that takes and automates one of the five senses, speech, touch, a vision, and so forth, and you build a system that automates that, that's AI. Like self-driving cars that looks at the road, sees the road, figures out how to take a right, how to take a left, and stop when there's a human, that's AI. So value innovation, as you heard before in the morning as well, you're trying to create a market where you're creating new value, improving the value, reducing the cost, and not going outside from the place where everybody is competing. Value innovation is, you know, you're trying to improve the buyer value, create new value, raise the current value, at the same time reduce the cost. One of the things that AI is super useful is AI can bring automation. A lot of times, AI automation can reduce cost. And not all the times, but many times, automation can increase buyer value as well. We ended up doing value innovation on customer service side without actually realizing it was value innovation. And that is probably one of the reasons now, when I look back, we were able to get pretty big customers right in the beginning. If you're trying to do the value innovation with AI, because building machine learning systems does require a lot of data, we as humans is able to take few samples of data and able to create coherent learning framework and decision making process. But for machines, it does require a lot of data. So is there enough data uh, is one of the big questions. And is there the right kind of data is another big question. And if you have unstructured data, how much unstructured data you have and how to process the unstructured data and all those questions related to data. The most successful AI systems are those where once you implement it and users start to use it, it generates data that can be fed back to the system. If you automate something that you do once a year, you know, maybe it's not that useful. But if you're able to automate something that somebody does every hour or every day or multiple times a day, then there's a lot of value to it. The more complex cognitive system that you try to emulate that human does, the harder it is. But the more simpler repetitive task you try to, to make machine automate, that's what you end up doing. And that's value innovation with AI. Thank you.